Hi there, my name is Sierra and I'm so excited to be a part of the Trek community. Today as my first official vlog, I thought it would be cool to do some sort of hiker introduction type thing. And to start things off, I guess we can start with my name. Uh, my name is Sierra, uh, a lot of people call me C, and I don't have a trail name yet, but I'm super excited to get one. So obviously I don't live in the tropics, I live in Maine, and we actually just got our first snow for the area today, and that's why I'm wearing gloves and a hat and a jacket, and I'm sitting here by the ocean, because I thought, like let's look at this ocean it's gorgeous even though it's rainy and sleety and snowy and windy and freezing now you can tell from the title why i'm probably a part of the trek and that is because i am doing a 2018 through hike of the pct and i am so 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 pumped and i don't even know how else to like say that without just saying so 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 pumped I usually am a solo hiker, but I'm doing the PCT with one of my good friends, Danielle. So you also might be wondering, if I'm from Maine and I live in this beautiful place of Maine, <laughs> why I'm doing the PCT and not the AT, and that would be because of a lot of reasons. And if you'd like to read those reasons, I'm going to link below a blog that I wrote for the trek and it's on why I'm hiking the PCT before the AT. So I guess one of the next questions that I get pretty frequently is regarding gear and what I'm doing for gear. Now I haven't written any blogs for the trek on that yet, but I'm working on a couple right now because I started my gear collection, I guess. I started purchasing gear about a week ago and I'm trying things out, seeing how I like them, waiting for discounts, waiting for coupons, using store rewards, all of that stuff. Now Dan and I are pretty similar in what we're seeking in our gear, but we're definitely going different paths on certain things. A lot of people have asked about permits and I actually saw a lot of hate on my permit video, which I think is kind of absurd because I just want to say that Danielle and I know that when we start the hike, the permits aren't the biggest of deals, but we also know that various places along the hike check permits. So that's why we got our permits. That is why we don't want to miss out on hiking or have to get off trail or get fined over something so minuscule as getting a permit when, although the process was very stressful, it's not that big of a deal. It was a half an hour of life and it's over and we have them. So for me, some of the gear pieces that I have purchased or I'm in the process of purchasing or customizing would be my tent. I purchased the Light Heart Tent, the So Long. I got the 2017 version of it and then I had a coupon and then I got some like extras and it's about $300. So not that bad for a tent that I've been watching and staring and looking at for months and months and months. Like I said, I'm from Maine, Dan's from Maine, and we really wanna support local business. So the pack we are going to get is some version of the Hyperlite brand. And we've seen reviews on them and whatnot, and we were looking at them and we were interested in them. And then we realized they're from Biddeford, Maine. So why not go down there? And we went down to the factory and spoke with a lot of people who work there. We're not certain on exactly which model we're gonna get, but we loved the packs. We loved everyone that was working there. It's a great company. All right, so sorry that was cut short. My phone did that thing where it gets really cold or really hot or really whatever it wants and it decides that it's gonna shut off when it's at like 80%. So, to conclude this vlog, all I'm saying is sometimes the gear that you like isn't what you like, and I don't know how that concludes this vlog, but that's how I'm gonna conclude it. <laughs> I am planning to do some sort of gear vlog or blog, depending on how I feel that day, and record kind of what I've been using and testing and buying and researching and what I have bought, what I plan to buy. So I will link down below all of my previous blogs from the trek and if you're interested in why I'm hiking the PCT before the AT, the permit process and what gear I'm doing so far and have picked so far, they are linked below. Don't forget to subscribe to the trek for more of my vlogs and everyone else's vlogs and all the cool things on here. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later.